Hi. Right in this question, I'm going to discuss about uh, the square root of net 1 minus 2x, which this expansion is using to uh, find the approximation of the square root of 6. So the question is asking you to expand square root of 1 minus 2x uh, in the ascending power of x uh, and up to the term in x square. All right. Also expand up to the term in x square. So all right, this is considered easy because the a is already b. So uh, a is already 1, sorry. So you have 1 minus 2x to the power of 1 over 2, right? 1 over 2. So this is already 1. So good, plus. So then you can start expanding. 1 plus, uh, you take the n, uh, the n multiplied with the b. The b is negative 2x, right? It's negative 2x, so n and the b. So. This is the term with x power 1. So now we go for another term. From 1 become power of 2, right? And 1 over 2, you add another bracket, you just minus 1, and the 2 become 2 uh, divided by 2 factorial, right? Very easy. The first three terms up to x squared. So this one you have uh, 1 minus x plus with, okay, this one you can use in calculator. Uh, which will give you uh, 1 over 2 multiply with 1 over 2 1 over 2 minus 1 right 1 over 2 minus 1 divide by 2 times with negative 2 to the power of 2 right don't forget the negative 2 power of 2 which give you uh, negative 1 over 2 x to the power of 2 right so means therefore the expansion of square root of 1 minus 2x you will have uh, this right so and in order for this expansion to be valid there is a condition uh, the b term here the b means that the, the b have to be less than 1 right the modulus of the b must be less than 1 so means that uh, modulus of negative 2 you have 2 modulus x less than 1 and modulus x less than 1 over 2 then the x is between 1 over 2 and negative 1 over 2 so this is the range for which the expansion is valid so which i have uh, mentioned many times so the question now is uh, asking you to find the rational approximation right rational approximation means that the answer that the, the approximate you have to give in the form of uh, fraction right rational means fraction so all right so uh, by substituting by substitute x equals to 1 over 50 into uh, into the expansion so you don't know also doesn't matter you just substitute and you, then later you will see uh, how you're going to modify this right so you have 1 minus 2 times with 1 over 50, right? Substitute into this equals to 1 minus 1 over 50 minus with 1 over 2, 1 over 50 square. Actually, there are many more, right? So after this, I'm going to write approximate. So this one, I'm going to change into uh, uh, a fraction because they want the rational approximation 50 uh, minus with 1 over 2 1 over 50 uh, square right 1 minus 1 over 50 minus 1 over 2 1 over 50 square so you have uh, 4 8 9 9 divided by 5000 lebih kurang this way right so for this one you have square root of uh, 1 minus right 1 minus 2 over 50 right 1 minus 2 over 50 you have 24 divided by 25 right ah the question now is they ask you to approximate and uh, they're asking you to approximate the value of square root of six right if you look at the question they were asking you to uh find a rational approximation of of square root of six so how are you going to modify this 
Uh, this is the result. You can't change the result. This is your result. So how do you want to using this to uh, find the approximate of square of six? So you have to think out how to extract the six out. So it means that okay, you can actually split this one into uh, twenty five. You know that twenty four six is also a factor of twenty four, right? So you know that six times four, right? Because six times four is twenty four. Then you have six here. Can you see that? Uh, you are modifying. So it's 4899 over with 5000. So now I'm going to, I, I'm going to re, uh, put the 6 inside the square root, but the 4 and 25 I take out. Because, okay, you can rewrite as square root of 6 multiplied with square root of 4 over 25, right? 4899 over 5000. Okay, uh, I use the concept of uh, third. So, square root of 4, you will have 2, right? Uh, square root of 4 over 5, 25 is 2 over 5, right? 2 over 5. So, therefore, the square root of 6 is approximately, by this is 2 over 5, right? 2 over 5. So, go over here, become 5 over 2 times with 4899 divided by 5000. So lastly, you know that therefore the square root of 6 approximately as a fraction, right? Rational approximation means that you will get a fraction here. So you using calculator, you will multiply with 5 over 2, multiply with uh, 4899 divided by 5000. So you will have 4899 divided by 2000. So this is the value of square root of 6. Okay, so you can check it's almost the same. Okay, this is just the approximation, right? So you take 4899 divided by uh, 2000. If you convert the decimal is 2.4495, right? So secretly, you know that this is 2.4495. But you can using calculator directly key in the square root of 6. Uh, you can key the square root of 6. This is for confirmation uh, to check whether. So square root of 6, you SD, you have 2.4495. If you round off, this is the exact value because you're using calculator. This is the approximate value. But the approximate value is the same as the value that you directly key in your calculator. So it means that your expansion is correct. right? Uh, so this is your answer uh, for this question. So hope you understand the question. Alright.